Welcome to tonight's news. I'm Hunter Hart. Here's your lead stories. A surprise surge in German factory orders had given a boost to UK stocks. This provides optimism after a dismal fall season. An 82-year-old woman was beheaded by a machete by an individually striking Muslim. Terrorism has been ruled out as the motive for this killing. A helicopter crashed into a construction crane, killing the pilot and another person. Thirteen others were injured from the falling debris. A scary view of London just got slightly scarier. At 138 feet above the city river Thames, the view from the newly opened glass walkway at Tower Bridge was already enough to generate high anxiety. Then, last Friday, someone dropped a beer and the glass shattered. The good news, says Tower Bridge officials, is that the breakage only affected a sacrificial panel covering the thicker glass below, and there was no risk to visitors. Two days after the incident occurred, at a private event, the glass has been repaired. The attraction remains open as normal. Now we'll give it over to Matt for sports. Matt? Thanks, Hunter. Now for the latest results for the English Premier League. London's three most popular teams are having mixed results in this year's standings. Chelsea tops the leaderboard with a total of 36 points, while Arsenal is within striking distance in sixth place with 23 points. Tottenham, the third most popular team in London, has a total of 21 points is in 10th place in the middle of the pack. Now, back to you, Hunter. Thanks, Matt. Arsenal sure does have a great squad this year. Let's see if they can bring a championship home. Aaron, how's the weather look out there? Currently in London, it's 40 degrees outside, but the rest of the week's forecast is a little chilly. Uh, Friday, it's going to rain, so I'd grab your rain jackets. Thanks, Aaron. Yeah, the winter weather is starting to move in, so make sure you guys bundle up out there. All right, that's it for tonight's broadcast. You guys have a great night.